each year I grow hibiscus, uh, roselle, some people call it sorrel, and I use the calyx uh, to make jam or I dry it for tea. I use it fresh for jam. And inside is a seed pod, and when it's green, you can boil them, extract the pectin, and use that water to make jam, natural pectin, so you don't need to buy pectin. And the largest calyxes, I let them go to seed and dry out on the bush and use those for next season. So I have a lot of seeds to share. And I would say each of these seed pods contain 20 seeds. But I'm going to let that large, great seed pod go to seed right on the bush. And I won't harvest it till the calyx is dry. I had a great season this year. I had about eight plants. And uh, I harvested and made over 15 pounds of jam. And harvested 15 pounds of calyxes to make dried calyx. This is the little flower. It's not quite open yet. Um, you can see an example of the flowers still attached to that calyx. So the flower dies and the calyx gets larger and larger and larger. And usually the flower falls out and uh, the calyx keeps growing. Here's another example of the little flower bud about to open. And it's still producing uh, new calyxes and flowers. But it's the end of the season and many of them have gone to seed. So I can be harvesting seed soon. You can see how cut back this group is. I've hacked away at it harvesting. 